Hey y'all, Love Biscuit here, and we are playing my necromancer Char. This is called Chain of Command, and we're near the Mustering Ground Waypoint, which is basically the entrance of the Black Citadel. So we're supposed to go and meet our warband. Or something. Yeah. <laughs> ah, our legionnaire steel band. So this is the second quest that um, is for the Char. Mine is a Blood Legion, I believe, so this would be the Blood Legion At least opening. She made it. That is Reva. She's also the person blood. that we picked during our creation screen that we wanted her to be our BFF. <laughs> I hear here for a second I was lost on what to do, but yeah, just walk forward. Well, look who finally came back. When Steelbane gets done with you, you'll wish you died with the rest of your warband. As if I cared what you think. Who are you? Why are you breathing at me? Sorosi Breaksteel. Steelbane recruited me, along with the others, to rebuild the warband. Wait, what? He's recruiting without asking us? Why are you breathing at me? <laughs> that was funny. Uh, I love my kitty. She's so cool. I know she's not a kitty. She's a char. But to me, she's a kitty. But I like how she's so ferocious. Why are you breathing at me? <laughs> so, I guess we'll go speak to our legionnaire. Legionnaire! Looks like some sewage just floated in from the battlefield. You... You get my best soldiers killed, and then have the nerve to stand there stinking up our barracks with your cowardly musk? I got them killed. Tell me something, boss. Who's in charge of this outfit? Who was giving the orders? You. Watch your tongue, Salter, or I'll have it removed for insubordination. Rage, teach this piece of waste how to address a legionnaire. With pleasure. Yeah, so look, I'm about to get my face pwned. Not really. Anyways, it's the guys next to you. I didn't realize it. I thought it was somebody else, but, you know, it happens. Anyways, so, some of the cutscenes I noticed bother me because they don't have... They're not voiced. I don't know if they did that on purpose or not, but... Either way, hopefully that gets fixed. I think that that is one of the small bugs that bothered me. And then there's a few graphical issues that I've had along the way that I didn't really like, but... Apart from that, I find this game to be really well polished already. I mean, yeah, it's got its bugs, but with the beta, that's the point of the beta, so hopefully we fix that. But anyways, there's a few waves of these guys you kill. I mean, they're not hard to kill, but I, was kind of, I felt kind of squishy. These necros are kind of squishy. But anyways, most people that have come across to think of a beta in a way that it's not. They think of it as a demo, and it's not. It's it's not a uh, demo. It's, it's a beta. It's something for you to test and help the developers to make it better. So it is ready to come out. But, I don't know. I came across a couple of people during the beta that were disappointed with some things. They didn't think that it was perfect, and they thought that it should have been better, and I was like, well, it's just a beta. They're like, it shouldn't matter, blah, blah. They were basically acting like it was a demo, and like, they were let down, and I don't know. To me, I wasn't let down at all. I have very, very high expectations for Guild Wars 2. I mean, I have been waiting for four years for this game, and I was not let down in the least. In fact, my expectations were surpassed by far. I had so much fun. Stand down! All of you! Stand down now! So, you fight your own warband better than you fight the enemy. Go on, get out of my sight while I figure out what to do with you. There's a load of supplies over at Telerange. Bring them to me. Double time! It's the only job you're fit for. Screw this up. 
And I will use your hide as a doormat. Understood? Understood, boss. Yeah, she wants to kill him, can you tell? Alright, so we're gonna head on out of here, but I end up stopping in a moment to speak with Reva. And basically what she tells us is that our warband is dead, all of them. And what's yeah, kind of sad is that it's basically like based off of the it. people that you could have chosen as your, I call it a BFF. It's like your best friend. And um, you had the choice of any of your warband to be your best friend. And then that's the one person that lives and follows you around. So, you know, for me, it made me a little sad thinking that I could have saved some of the others. But I didn't. But yeah, she basically says that everybody died and... Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it, really. You can read it as I'm rambling, because I'm going to keep rambling. I'm not going to shut up. <laughs> Anyways, the Blood Fiend for the Necro is kind of gross. I don't really like the undead pets for fight, the Necro. I really don't. Um, I mean, they're undead, so I assumed that they'd be kind of grody, but I don't know. They don't really seem real, I guess? I mean, okay, it's a fantasy game, I get it, they're not real, but to me, you know, I when I think of a necro, I'm bringing up the undead, so it would be, you know, like, the rotting corpse of a char, because I'm a char, and I'm killing chars, or something, you know, or whatever, but they're not, they're like blood fiends, and I got bone minions later on, and yeah. I didn't level up very high on any of my characters during this beta week, and I didn't have as much time to play as I had hoped, but um, I'm a mom, so yeah, I'm not going to ignore my kid to play a game all day. I wanted to, but I'm not going <laughs> to. Um, so I didn't get up as high as I wanted, but hopefully next time. But I was also wanting to show all of you the different races and some of different cutscenes and openings and blah blah blah. But, um, right now we're just off to go and get the supplies, that stupid dude, steel bait or whatever. So that's where we're going over there. Sorry for the yawn. So we're gonna head out that way. But, um, yeah, the Necro overall, I mean, it's a, it is a fun class. The pets kind of threw me off, but, um, it can be a good support class. Um, it's just, I don't know, I really like it. I had fun with it. But, um. I'm not, sh I'm, I'm really not leaning towards it as the first one that I play on launch, so. But it is still a really fun class, and I do plan on playing it. So, it's actually where we need to go is right up this hill, so we're going to hit up that and go ahead and get in there. Ooh, look at that, 47 XP. I like these, um, very watercolor painted pictures that we get to see. And, and here's Reva, she meets us here. We're gonna run up here and get another little cutscene. No, an Iron Legion marksman is dead. Bitches. I hate you. I don't know what to try to do. The rest of your warband defected voluntarily. Don't be stubborn. Why fight for blood when you can cook for Flame Legion? Females have it easy with us. You want me to desert and join you so you can demote me to fry cook? Please! I've killed a hundred males twice your size. Fall in line or fall on a blade. I don't care which. No luck trolling for recruits at the pig farm? You Flame Legion stiffs must be desperate. I came here for supplies. But this is a lot more fun. If it's fun you want, recruits, let's send Blood Legion a message. Bury these idiots and destroy those supplies while you're at it. Anyone else notice how that recruit looks just like Sealbane? Or am I alone in this? Anyway, so with these guys, I ended up just getting some distance. I mean, they're only two. Well, some are up higher, but um, these are only two. But I'd like to be. I don't know. I'm a caster. I like to be a distance. I'm a ranged class. I like to be ranged. Just how I how I roll, I guess. So take out these guys pretty quickly, and then you have the help of um, the shred skin chick. So so 
not too bad. And I was still getting used to the necro. Um, I had, yeah, my AoE stuff and whatever. Um, right now I'm using a Warhorn and a Axe. I've been calling it a Tomahawk, but yeah, I've been using them. Also, your pets do get aggro, so they can take... They don't take a lot of damage, though, that's the only thing with it. So they die really quick, which is a nuisance for me. Why do they get aggro? They shouldn't get aggro unless I tell them to. But, that's just me. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I'm using the axe and warhorn right now. Um, I think the staff was my favorite with the necro. I had a lot of AoE stuff. Enemy contact. We'll take over again. And now I'm gonna loot the dead. Might makes right. Even though I should be killing things, I'm looting the dead. Look at me, I'm a looter. But, yeah, so for me, I really liked, um, the staff. I believe it was the staff, because it had the most AoE stuff. With the little circle on the ground, and it does, like, a whole AoE thing, which I liked. Um. But, I mean, they're all interesting. I really like the spells. The combat in this game is cool. I like how you can use so many different weapons and, you know, they have their own spells or attacks. I really like that. You know, I like the attunement with, like, the elementalist. That's fun. I don't know. They all have their neat things and, I don't know, I really have a lot of fun with it. And I'm also finding this very R R RPG-esque. That's right, I have an esque fan of a lot of stuff. Anyways. I really do. Um, I think anybody who likes RPGs would really be into this game, and you don't have to pay to play, which is a huge win for me. And you basically, um, you know, you play it. I spent the entire weekend by myself. And what's really great is you can still get really amazing gear with your karma points that you get from dynamic events, doing quests, and things like that. So, I mean, you could play this entire game all by yourself if you wanted to, or, you know, go with some friends and have fun. But I really like the RPG stuff. It's really cool. I liked it. I knew this Why did that guy just stand there, the engineer? Master in the legions. Whatever you needed, he had it. My whole war band deserted for the promise of power. Never thought I'd see something like that. I have nothing left but my life. If you'll have me in your ranks, it's yours. We need soldiers, and you can clearly handle yourself in a scrap. Welcome to the warband. Just be warned, my legionnaire is going to drown us for losing those supplies. I hope you can swim. Don't worry, I can hold my breath for a long time. I'll take punishment over death, or being a gladium. Lead on. And that was the second quest for my Char Necro um, called Chain of Command. I hope you guys had fun. I'm Love Biscuit, and I'll see you guys soon.